Hey everyone, it's Miranda from Diamond Painting with the Besties. How are you? I hope everyone is doing well. I bet you see a box in front of me. And if you've been here a while, this plain brown shipping box might start looking a little familiar to you. Um, it's adorned with some fun stickers. Um, I can't show you too much because my address is on the other side. But this is from Pam's Diamond Paint, Pam Diamond Paintings. Um, if you guys have not checked out Pam, you're really, really missing out. Do not sleep on this. Um, so these are uh, my latest kits that um, I received. I've had them for quite some time, and there is a surprise in here for Brad. But if you know me, you know I am a fan, massive fan for anything 80s related and pop culture. And this unboxing is nothing less than that. Um, Pam has such a wide variety of artists. She literally caters to everyone. She has thousands of images. And let me tell you, I'm gonna give you a little inside scoop. Stay tuned because there are gonna be some, becoming some fun, fun things I'm gonna be showing you uh, from Pam. And you definitely gotta see it. So anyway. There is an artist that she licenses that I am absolutely obsessed with um, and hopefully you guys will as well um, when uh, I'm done with this. So this is just my invoice right here letting me know um, what kits I have. And I'm going to be showing you, there are three kits in here, but um, two are the same because like I said, one is for Brad. And um, so it will come in this very sturdy brown box right here and it will become wrapped in um, paper. But with every purchase, you get a handwritten card from Pam. This one is bursting at the seams as well as, you know, an invoice. So, um, it's a little thank you card, and there's looks like there's some goodies in here. <gasps> Ooh. So let me read the card. It says, thank you. Best wishes for you. So here's a thank you. Uh, make it a great day. Miranda, thank you for your order and your continued support is greatly appreciated. And then uh, I have a little coupon code. But she sends goodies. So it looks like we have a little baby Jack Skellington necklace right here. That is super, super cute. And we have some cover minders, some Jack and Sally cover minders. So I'm really, really excited about that. So if you're new, cover minders are just these cute little adorable um, emblems like things, right? And they have uh, magnets on the back and it holds the plastic back and they're cute to look at while you're diamond painting. And then my absolute favorite thing in the whole world, stickers. So we have a little Hello Kitty, Sally and Jack. Sally and Jack, and make your own kind of music. Oh, yeah, I surely do. So thank you so much, Pam, for those goodies. I absolutely, totally, 100% appreciate it. I'm going to stick that over here. So let us see. Why is this going like that? I'm so sorry, you guys. Let me fix you. Okay. So like I said, it comes with paper wrapped around it. Oops, so we get that. Let me uh, get these toolkits out of here. Everything comes nice and neatly wrapped for you, but I want to make sure that I get out one of these kits. Okay, I'm gonna have to pause you, I'm so All right, now that I'm all set to go, I'm going to show you the toolkits. Um, I'm not gonna go into much detail because I've shown them multiple times, but this is what they look like. You get washi tape, um, really nice washi, um, tweezers, squishies, multi-placers, a wax, um, diamond painting pen, everything you need to diamond paint in these really cute organza bags. So are we ready for the first, um, the very first kit? I am very, very excited. This is actually way before the 80s, but it is a couple that all of us spooky guys and gals have grown to love. And that is Herman and Lily Munster. 
So this is titled Lillian Herman. It says 60 by 80 round diamond painting kit. Um, I chose to do round. You get two legends. So up at the top first, you have the kit number and the size, and then of course, Pam's branding. Um, and then over here in the lower left, you have a legend. And then in the upper right, you have a legend. At the bottom, you have her saying right here, cherish the beauty in every sparkle. And then you have the title of the piece and um, who it is licensed by. And the artist for this particular kit is Bawana Devil Art. They, Bawana Devil Art, they are a husband wife team and I am obsessed with their artwork. Um, they are literally my favorite artist that Pam has on her uh, license on her site. And you guys, this is just adorable. This little portrait, it's literally amazing. It looks just like them. Now, you do get a sticker sheet right here. And you do get a thumbnail. Um, I have been talking to Pam and she is going to be working on seeing if it can be enlarged a little bit. Um, and then I do believe that some of these are going to become pre-cut. But as for right now, you can cut your own out, which is fine. Um, because if you need to, you can kind of cut them smaller or, and they don't have to worry about them coming up. But this entire thing is a sticker sheet. And um, why are these, what is going on here? Oh, look at this one. This one may be your fake. But I have another one. I have another one in here. And these are the grills. So let me get it out right here because there are 47 colors in this diamond painting. But it is not showing what the ADs are. So they're probably going to show on the inventory. So let me get that out for you. It's really, really quick. All right, so this one is a paper one, which is okay. So this particular um, kit is from a different supplier that she's trying out. So this is just a paper legend right here. I'm not quite sure why these um, numberings are all out of order like that, um, but yeah, that's really weird. It goes seven, nine, 10, and they're down here. But anyway, it's got one, two, three, four, five, six ABs in here. So I'm very, very excited to take a look at that. So before we get too much into that, let us zoom in and take, ooh, not that much, not that much, Miranda, and take a closer look. So the symbols are very, very clear. There are no guide circles anywhere. Now there are two pieces of plastic, which I actually prefer um, with these larger canvases because it cuts down with any sort of tearing that could possibly happen. Now, the one thing I noticed right here is the signature of the artist. Um, I don't know if I'm going to put that on there. It doesn't look like it's going to come out. I'm not quite sure what that's supposed to say because it's not in, it, it is in the thumbnail, but it is very, very tiny. So I might block that out, even though I actually like having it on there. Um, but this actually looks like a really, you know, normally Pam's kits are very confetti heavy, which is fine because that's where you get that detail, right? But I do see lots of opportunities you know, for using your multi-placer. Um, their faces are very clear. I'm not quite sure what's going on with that hand. The fingers right here do look a little blurry, but that is okay because the faces. So hopefully you can see that with the symbols without the glare. We've got, now I do, would, I would like to see um, lighter symbols on the darker because this is, very dark and it has dark symbols on it. Um, and then we have the light symbols with the dark, so I do like that. I use a light pad, so it's probably not gonna be that big of a deal, but for some people it might. Another thing I really, really enjoy is we've got this border around them, kind of making it look like a portrait or a, you know in a frame already. So I do really, really like that. So let's turn this over and kind of go over um, the colors. There are a lot of colors, so. So we have 163, 165, 
3740, if you hear that, the cats are playing with the paper. 640, 613, 564, 3052, 912, 911, and 502. 472, 319, 644, That just loose check your bags, people. 772 926 3072 3812 5200 3809, 3053, 385, 3834. Our very first AB, you guys, ooh, 747. That is stunning. Put that over here. 3810, 3823 is our second AB. 3756, I love that. 3371. And then 413 and 318. I've never had 318. That is gorgeous. Big bag of 939. 3848. 3815-3363-3799. 3856-3032. 3750, and last but not least, we have 3808. So very, very, it actually is an actually bright, colorful kind of color palette. You know, we do have our darker colors, but we've got these lots of these blues and different shades of green. So I'm going to sh stop this, put this stuff away. We'll take a look at our ABs again and find out where they go. All right, now that I have this all put away, Let's flip this back over and see where these ABs go, my friends. Okay, I'm going to zoom this out just a little bit. All right, so we have some pretty basic symbols right here. I want to show them to you in case I have a hard time describing them. So first we have, um, it's a six. 8318 right here. So I have really, I'm going to be honest, I do have quite a hard time finding um, where the ABs go on these larger canvases. I really, so I do apologize for that. It might be a little difficult. So I'm going to move on. Then we have that kind of TV antenna looking for the brown. Again, I have no idea. Next, we have that kind of like Greek looking symbol right there in the 3756. So just a very, very little bit. Why am I unable to, excuse me if I'm blocking I'm literally unable to find any of these. That is so weird. Wow, that's weird. Next is the equal sign, and that is going to be the 3823 right here. I'm glad there's no ABs in her face. Okay, so there's Greek symbol in her eyes and then one in Hurin's eyes. So at least we found where that goes. The equal sign. 
Okay, and then there's some more of the Greek symbols down over here. My eyes, and yeah, they're basically sprinkled everywhere, as well as the equal signs. I'm trying to look where there's like lighter images. Oh, they're in her hair. So those will be in Lily's hair. That's, and then we have the eight. So I just saw a bunch of the eights. Okay, so those are also gonna be sprinkled throughout. And then last but not least, the 747 uh, is the letter Q. And I'm pretty sure those are gonna just be sprinkled throughout as well. So I apologize deeply apologize for not being able to find any of these ABs, but trust me, they are in there. Um, I am, I'm just really, really, really in love with this piece. Um, and I hope you guys like it too. What do you think of this one? So if you enjoyed this, oh my goodness, I'm just gonna have to put this in however, right? I don't want to hold you guys up. It's already going to be a super, 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 super long video. All right. So, if you guys liked this one, you are really, really going to enjoy this next one. All right. So, we're going to flip this over. And let me make sure this is the right way. So, I can just flip it. And it is. Then we have Gremlins. You guys, Gremlins, another one by Bawana Devil Art right here. This is just screams my childhood. We have Stripe up at the top being naughty. We've got Gizmo scared out of his wits in the little box. And I forgot Old Girl's name, but she's here protecting um, Gizmo. And I got one of these for me and one for Brad. And I'm super, super excited about this one. I mean, how can you not be excited? This is a 60 by 80 and this one is a square. And these are the drills. And there are 50 colors in this kit, you guys. 50 colors with four ABs in here. And a lot of confetti but it's just gonna make it absolutely amazing when it is finished. Um, there are gonna be a lot of dark colors, but also some light, like that really pretty green right here. You do get another inventory sheet, which is a sticker. Now this is from her original um, supplier. Now uh, me personally, like I think this rendering is more detailed, but I personally cannot tell um, really how to look until I get my drills down on it. But tell me, which one do you think looks better? I just, oh my God, I'm losing my mind. Okay, so we have our poke scalped edges, just like the first one. Um, lots of confetti. Um, I love her hair. I love her face. Uh, Bawana Devil Art, they do such a great job with these renderings. I mean, it almost looks like a movie poster. So what do you guys think of this one? All right, let's get into the drills. Um, you guys, I don't know, this is already going really, really long. I'm gonna kind of show you the drills. I'm gonna pick out these ABs. But besides the fact there are these dark colors, we also have got like greens and blacks. I mean, we have this really, really cool 704. A lot of 939 in here, but I really would like to try and find <coughs> the AB. Right here. So I know you guys like seeing the drills, so instead of me wasting time and calling all out, I'm going to pause the video, lay them out so you can see them. All right, here are all the drills laid out, you guys, and it has a really, really nice color palette. You know, we do have our darker greens and backgrounds, but there is yellow and blues and pinks in here. And here are our ABs. We have 704, we have a darker 904, we have 608, and then last but not least, we have a really nice size bag of 445. So let's put these in here. 
So, I remember seeing Gremlins. Oh, I don't even remember what year it came out, but I know it was early. I know that my parents took us in the theater, and I know it was scary to me at the time, but literally, like, Gizmo was the absolute cutest thing in the entire world. What is your guys' favorite 80s movie? And trust me, they have a lot more on Pam's site if you want to dabble in some of your inner retro, if you're an 80s kid. I was uh, born in the 70, 70s, raised in the 80s, or grew up in the, grew up in the 80s. I remember when MTV first came on. So let me just put all of these back in here real quick. We're almost done. And hopefully I will have a better time than I did with the last kit to show you where these ABs go. I'm just really being a slob. I'm not very good at putting drills back, even if they are free bag. This is a very long bag. So I'm gonna put the ABs back in here. I'm gonna put the inventory back in here, but I'm gonna put them this way. Okay, so let me just tighten this up real quick before they go everywhere. I'm gonna just fold it in. Sorry, you guys. This is, I gotta clean as I go. All right. So let's zoom in, shall we? And Let's look for the cues. Again, I don't know if I'm going to be very successful finding any of this. We have cues. We have the. Let's see if I can find. God. Okay, so we have some yellow AB in the moon. And then the red. The red and stripes eyes and in his mouth, those are some ABs. We have a couple ABs right here on the lens of the 3D glasses. Um, let's see. I don't know where that Q is. It should be somewhere down here because it's that darker. Okay, here we go all in here. So when you kind of see this darker green, so it'll be highlighted on stripes. So he's going to have some ABs on him. I don't think it, no ABs on Gizmo, but that's okay. Poor sweet baby Gizmo. But yeah, you guys, um, I am absolutely like over the moon with how beautiful both of these kits are. Both of these kits will be linked below. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Uh, don't forget, you know, check out Pam. Join her Facebook group. Um, she is also on YouTube and on Instagram. She's always having sales or some sort of special. Tons of new releases. Tons of artists to choose from. Like I said, something for everyone. So other than that, you guys, I'm going to get out of your hair. I hope that you have a fabulous rest of your day. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.